Hi friends, my name is Michelle and welcome to A Day in the Life with me. Today's video is going to be me getting all of this off my face and being lazy and not going downstairs to a sink. Uh, what this look is, is from the RBSG collab, season three, I believe it was episode eight. If you want to check it out, head on over and check it out. I will try to leave it in a in the description box below. I'm not going to explain the look. You're going to have to go check it out. Anyway, what I'm going to do is wash my face and show you guys how easy it is to take off this face paint. Um, if you watched any of my videos, you saw that I did a second annual uh, clown collab with just Jessica and I bought this face paint for that purpose <clears throat> and come to find out I have other uses for it as well so I when I first put this on I will preface in that video for the clown collab I said my face was itchy I think it was itchy because I had just dermablated my face before filming that video not a smart idea don't recommend it don't do it don't just don't just don't do it don't do it but this time I didn't microderm my flate my face because the hairs haven't really grown back yet so I'm going to show you how I got how to get all of this off your face without having to really use a sink if you have a bottle of water wet washcloth Makeup Melt Away, got this from uh, Ipsy Plus, back when it was Ipsy Plus. I will be using some micellar water and my um, face wash that I received from Influencer probably about a year and a half, maybe two years ago. Well, no, it's probably two years ago. Uh, it's part of the collection. I believe I had the serum was in my last project pan so I will be using this to also help get everything off my face because I, kn I know it's orange and um, I, it's going to take some stuff to get off my face. So what I need to do first, oh and I also have a spray bottle of water. I've had this forever. Uh, I will not buy another one because it's literally just a spray bottle of water. Uh, but I do use it. So we're going to spray my face first. Now the only difference between the Cologne collab and this one is I did not use the setting powder that came with that. So I did not use this setting powder because it's white and I didn't want to use white. So let's spray my face, then spray my face, then rub my face, wipe my face, repeat. All right, so here we go. It is, um, hopefully I don't have to cut anything out. Right now, we're at three minutes. Set the timer now. I'm not gonna fast forward, I'm not gonna speed up. I'm gonna show you guys just how long it's gonna take me to clean this off my face. All right, here we go. Spray it with the water. Again, you could splash your face if you wanted to. I've never been able to do that myself. I've never been able to be over a sink and splash my face. I, it gets on my shirt more than it gets on my face. So, I mean, there's that. And then I'm using this spray one. I guess you guys don't need to set a timer because I'm going to run my mouth through the whole thing. So normally, you know, I do have my favorites that are like the balm, but I didn't want to use the balm. I wanted to use the spray because I, I want to use this up uh, being completely honest want to use it up nothing wrong with it just want to use it up <coughs> don't breathe in after you spray your face and then just rub might have to do it a couple times
there is some coming off on my hand and why would I have a paper towel I mean why what's the point in that I'm gonna spray some more and I'm not gonna breathe it in this time I think the stuff that's coming up in like clumps is from the eyeliner that I used for the whiskers. Yeah, because that was eyeliner that was on my eyes, not the face paint. Alright, I'm just going to spray my face with some water. Try to get most of this off, and then we're going to go in with the micellar water. I actually have one of those continuous spray um, bottles from like Amazon. I wonder if I could put micellar water in that. So I could spray it. Boy. Alright, I am seeing a little bit of staining look on my nose and on my lips. <laughs> Correction, make that all over my face. And I know, I'm going to get a bunch of people saying, don't push so hard. Why are you wiping your face so hard with that washcloth? You shouldn't do that. It's my face, and I do. Alright, so it looks like I got the majority of it off with just this and some water, but I still see orange on my face. So I'm going to grab some cotton rounds, which I need to pick up more of micellar water this I should have shown you but this one um, separates I don't I'm guessing it's supposed to uh, it's from Avant this was in uh, BoxyCharm or Ipsy N none of my skincare stuff I purchased myself it was all well I mean I guess I purchased it myself because I purchased the boxes that it went with but you know, I didn't, like, go to the store and be like, oh, I want to try this. The only one of those would have been the, um, whoa, Nelly. Look at that. It's what was still left on just part of my face. So we are going to add some more. I don't really have a skincare routine. I, I should probably have one, um, especially if I plan on, I mean, if I wear makeup, then obviously I clean my face, but if I don't wear makeup, and this is probably horrible beauty YouTuber, I don't wash my face every day. And I mean, my skin is not that bad. I have a zit right there, but I also have been wearing makeup more than normal still more so I'm just going to continue doing this until it's I don't have anything on the pad and then I'm going to go in with that other the Garnier stuff and wash my face or actually I mean it's lightening up so I think what I might do is use the Garnier stuff now and then when I'm done with that go over my face again because that is what is and I'm gonna keep this one out so that is what is left on it 
after the third time, and this was all over the face. So, I mean, it's face paint, guys. Obviously, if I had just done regular makeup, there wouldn't be that much on my face. This doesn't go on here. It goes on here. This lid goes on here because I am a klutz, if you don't know me. Spray it with water again. Also going to spray my hands with water. Put some of this in my hands. There is a girl, and I don't know if she's... I think I mostly see her on like Facebook Reels. It might be Instagram Reels or TikToks or something. But she, every time she does her makeup, she use, uses Ferrera Rocha. La Poche something. La Roche something. Thermal water. She always sprays her face with that before doing anything else to her face. I'm not really going to put it on my lids or anything. I may put this face wash in the shower because it smells good and it feels good. Now I need to wipe my hands off. And again, why would I have more than one? I mean, I guess I have a towel behind me. Spray the face again. And wipe again. Okay, there's still some. I'm going to try to zoom you guys in. There is still some of the eyeliner, and it is this. LA Girls liquid eyeliner that I used so I can still see I still have some of that on my eyelid and that is what was like pilling up it wasn't the face paint at all it was that um, eyeliner Alright, I feel like everything is off. It feels like everything is off, so I'm going to go in for my final, just make sure it's all gone. And go in again with the micellar water. And just remember, this is what it looked like before I did the face wash and now let's see if the face wash got it all my cellar water at it I mean it's still showing some So there is the new one. You still see the stuff on it. And there was the old one. So I'm going to wipe again and see if I still get some. Just because I sincerely thought my face was clean. 
So <laughs> let's do it again. My face is getting agitated with this micellar water and I don't know why. Maybe it's because it hasn't been scrubbed this much. My eyes are getting irritated. And again, it's still showing some. So it looks like maybe you can't just wash this off without a sink. Hmm. My face is agitated. I'm not doing it anymore. Looks like I will be going downstairs and washing my face. I will be right back. Okay, so now my face is very, very clean, and we're going to go in with our project pan. So using the toner, and what I've been doing is a little bit different than what I was doing when I first started using this project pan, um, the face stuff. So normally, you know, I do the, the toner. And remember, whatever you do to your face, you should do to your neck and your decolletage. And as you can see, my face is clean. I do somehow have eyeliner on my fingernail? Not sure how that happened. So face is clean, has toner, and then I use the one that goes with the toner, the Glow Recipe. Watermelon glow niacinamide glue drop glow drops and See the size of this is a eye cream. I ain't never gonna use up all of this eye cream ever so I Put some eye cream on my finger Don't mind the nails. I just took my polish off last night trying to let them breathe a little bit and then Probably did too much of both of those. Rub it together. Put it on the face. Yep, I definitely have too much on. I know you're supposed to go up. Alright, got that all on. Then lastly, my confidence in a cream. And I don't use a whole lot of this just because it, it smells like hospital. I don't know how else to explain it, but it smells like hospital. Now I have a very dewy, glowy finish to my face, so I look oily. And now my face is ready for more makeup if I wanted to put it on which I'm not quite sure if I want to do that. But if I did, I would be all set and ready to go. 
All right, guys, so that is how you take off the face paint from You Can Be. And I actually did do it all up here. After I paused you guys, I sprayed my face with that water again, went in with a makeup wipe, and got it all off. And that is how I washed my face without using a sink. Because I'm lazy. All right, guys, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Or thumbs down, doesn't matter, it just helps with the YouTube al algorithm, pushes me out to other people to see. Leave me a comment down below, make sure you're subscribed, because I have noticed about 50% of my viewers are not subscribed to my channel. Ring the notification bell so you're notified of each and every upload. As always guys, remember, be kind to one another, you know the rest. Bye! -er.